Patrick Sean saw it. My name is Kuroki. I'm a shy businessman with no special talents. But at 26, I got a girlfriend for the first time. Akane is a wonderful girl who's honestly too good for a guy like me. I met her at one of our clients' companies. Hello! Hello. May I speak to Tachibana-san from the development department? <sighs> Tachibana-san's the scary one who doesn't talk much. Despite those looks, Tachibana-san is actually a dog lover. Is that so? So talk about dogs. It'll help ease attention. Ah. She was a receptionist, and I fell in love at first sight. Look! It's my baby, Yuri! Isn't she a beauty? <laughs> yeah, she is. Thank you so much. It went well. I fell in love with her smile and cheerfulness. I asked her out for the first time in my life. Even after we started dating, her smile never changed. However, it might just be my imagination, but she's been acting a little strange lately. And then... <coughs> she's been extremely sensitive to the sound of her phone notifications. What's wrong? Ah, the lid's stuck. It won't open. Give it to me. And sensitive to other sudden sounds. <sighs> hmm. Did you hear a woman's voice just now? What? It was just someone passing by, right? <clears throat> this didn't happen when we first started going out. Then the incident happened. Invited to her house for the first time after four months of dating. Hey, welcome. <sighs> Good morning, Akane. You're sweating a lot. Akane? Are you tired? You okay? Hey! The tea! What? Not at all. Maybe it's because I stayed up all night cleaning yesterday. Oh, I see. Yeah, I got you these before I came. Wow, thanks! Strawberry flavor looks delicious! Let's eat it while watching the movie. Don't let him get away! Chase him! How did you find out about this place? What's going on, Azami? I'm a spy for the Etras. What? Why did you keep this from me all this time? At first, I was just trying to steal your data. But then I fell in love with you! It was just getting good. I'll pause it. Sorry. Yes? <laughs> what? What's wrong, Akane? Who was it? N nobody Sorry, Kuroki. Can you go out on the balcony for a minute? The balcony? Take your shoes! Don't even make a sound! What? What's going on? Make sure to stay out of sight, okay? Yes. The lock? Wait! Akane! Wait, wait, what? What the hell is going on? Did someone come in? Wait, this situation... No way! Is Akane actually a spy who just got her cover blown by the enemy organization? No! I must be watching too many movies. <laughs> it's not normal. What if she was just cheating with me and that's her real boyfriend? <laughs> Hello, I'm her boyfriend, John. No way, Akane would never do that. Uh, but that would be the most realistic. <sighs> what are they arguing about? <laughs> Akane? <sighs> I might be able to take a peek from here. <sighs> a woman? So the boyfriend theory is gone. Phew. Is it the enemy organization after all? <laughs> Akane? What? What's going on? Akane might be in danger if I don't do something. I need to save her. Akane, open up! Akane! Kuroki! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! What the hell is going on? Who are you? Uh, it is what it is. <laughs> She's crazy! Stop, Yazuria! Uh, uh, I'll call the police! <laughs> you told me we were gonna be happy together. I'll never forgive you. She's hyperventilating. Are you okay, Akane? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> the police arrived shortly after, and the woman was taken away in an ambulance. Akane and I were interviewed at the police station. Was your name Akane? Uh, um... They're apparently friends. And you? I'm her boyfriend. We happened to be in the room together. Akane was too distraught to speak, 
I spoke on her behalf for a while and explained to the police what I had just witnessed in the room. <sighs> Thanks, Kuroki. I'll do the rest myself. Good. She seems to have calmed herself. How long have you been friends with her? Um, Yasuria. I met her two years ago at a bar I frequented. Er. <laughs> hey, I was wondering if you'd like to have a drink with me. Uh, sure. We hit it off from there. We started hanging out as friends, going shopping, having sleepovers. Akane, listen. Mm-hmm. As an only child, I was happy because I felt like I had a sister. And then... I have a surprise report for you two today! Hmm? Tell me, tell me. There was a guy named Kuroki at my client's company, and he asked me out, so we started going out! <gasps> Wait, Yasuria? I thought you'd be happy. Why? What? Why would you go out with a guy like that when I'm the closest to you? What? Why? I love you so much more! She confessed her love to me for the first time. I see. But I'm sorry, I didn't mean it that way about you, Yasuria. Uh, it's okay. I'm sorry I startled you. I should get going. Yasuria! She didn't do anything then, but after a while... I still can't forget about you, Akane. I love you. I want to see you. Er, uh, Yasuria kept contacting me and the messages got creepier and creepier. We're bonded by our past lives. Yesterday's date was fun. I'll never forget that night. Dade? What is she talking about? We haven't even met since then. I don't know what to do. I'm scared. Why didn't you tell me? I'm sorry. I didn't want you to worry. So I met up with her once and told her to leave me alone, but if it escalates any further, I'm thinking of taking it to the police. Wait! I'm sorry. I didn't mean to bother you, Akane. I... I actually have depression. What? If you go to the police, I'll have no choice but to kill myself! No! Okay, I won't go to the police, but you have to stop. Okay, I'm sorry. A month later. Good thing Azuri hasn't contacted me since then. Tomorrow's the first time Kuroki's coming over, so I have to tidy up. <laughs> Are you still seeing that guy? I've got an idea. We just need to get rid of the obstacle. Yazuria, what are you talking about? So today, Yazuria came to my house. I told her to leave because I didn't know what she would do if she ran into Kuroki, but... If you don't let me in, I'll kill myself here! So I had no choice but to let her in. You bitch! You liar! I want my life back! What are you talking about? Stop right now and go home already! So you don't need me anymore. <gasps> yeah! Sorry. Why are you apologizing, Kuroki? If I had been more dependable... That's not true! Even today, I don't know what would have happened if you weren't here! <laughs> In the end, we didn't report the damage this time. After discussing it with Yuzuriha's parents, they promised to keep her away from us, and she was admitted to a psychiatric hospital. Then we moved in and started living together. Kuroki, look, what do you think of this? It's a swimsuit. Yeah, it looks great! I'm glad she's calmed down from that state of shock. From now on, we'll be able to confide in each other about anything. You have been gaining weight lately, though. I beg your pardon. ご視聴いただきありがとうございました。気持ちはわかりますよ。彼氏より私の方が絶対一緒にいて楽しい自信があるもんとか奪われたとかそういう嫉妬してしまうことはありますよ。<笑> それでも友達の幸せを一番に願うことがその子のためなんです。それじゃ自分の幸せを手に入らないと思うかもしれませんが、愛する人に恐怖を植え付けてまで手に入れることが幸せなのか、私はそうは思いませんがね。皆さんは